thank you for giving this opportunity to build my career in leadership excellence today's my topic is jan fraser jan fraser is the chief executive officer of cct the world most global bank which serves millions of consumers business and institutions of across nearly 160 countries and she is the first female ceo in the firm history Jan Fraser was born in ST Andrews Scotland she attended Gritton College Cambridge from 1985 to 1988 graduated with an BA and promoted to an MA per tradition in economics after graduating she worked in a mergers and acquisitions analytics at Goldman Sachs London from July 1988 to 1990 1992 She joined Harvard Business School, earning MBA in 1994. In 1994, she joined McKinsey Company and working in financial service and global strategies. Eventually, rising to partner. For the first six years, she worked in New York, and for the last four years, she worked in London. She worked part time while raising her young children. She wrote an articles on globalizations and personally co-authored with the three other McKinsey employees of 1999 book for Rise. The research of the book, she traveled to China, Hong Kong, Indonesia, Singapore, and India to interview McKinsey clients about their global challenges. After she hired, speak about the book, Citigroup executive Michael Lane spent several years encouraging to make her move on Citi's group. She eventually did, and Citi's group joined in two thousand. Four into area head of client strategy in City Group Investment and Global Banking individually in two thousand four. In October two thousand seven, she was promoted to a global head of strategy and mergers and acquisition in a position to held a make in two thousand nine. Head financial crisis of two thousand seven to two thousand nine, and she was the part of executive team that was charged with restricting the group, leading a re-energizing effort to making divestment and raising new capital. In October two thousand nineteen, Fraser was appointed to president of City Group and head of the global consumer banking GCB, and was responsible for all of the city's consumer business, including retail, bank, and wealth management, credit and mortgage, and operations technologies. In September two thousand twenty, City Group was announced to see of Michael Corbett retirement it to be effective in February two thousand twenty one. Fraser was appointed to a succeed Corbett, becoming the first female CEO of the top tier Wall Street investment, leading the third largest bank in USA. Fraser was taken approach to work during the COVID nineteen pandemic that differs from the CEO of. permanent to plan all work in the during the some work from home of the some days of the week fraser had taken an approach to to work during the covid 19 pandemic that differs from ceo instituting permanent plans to allow works to start some days of the week and granting staff strain greater flexibility to schedule all other times in the wall street fraser became city ceo in march 2021 and is the one of the first women should to lead a major financial institution fraser is married and mother of two sons and arbus and her husband albert pedro former banker of native of cuba left to job as bank manager in europe during the financial crisis of 2008 to spend more time on caring to their young children thank you